Disclaimer, before performing any exercise program, please use common sense and follow the advice of your doctor or medical professional to reduce and avoid injury. By performing any fitness exercises, you are performing them at your own risk. High Liberty Fitness cannot be liable for the outcomes of your actions. Thanks for your understanding. All right, here we go. Starting with an easy march. Let's big breath in all the way to the top. Let it go, shake it out. Beautiful, good morning all you beautiful people. I can see all your screens now. Inhale, lift. Exhale, let it out. All right, let's add some movement. Here we go, step touch, easy step touch. So we're start off small, starting with the foundations all the time. So let's put our hands on our hips, lower our shoulders from the ears. Nice and easy step touch, side to side. If you wanna make this a little bit stronger, stand up tall, zip it up through the center. So rather than keeping your knees generously bent, let's take the bend out of the knees, lift the sternum, squeeze the inner thighs together as you step over to the side and back. Let's add a curl. Right here. Curl the arms up as if you're getting ready for a bicep curl with some weights, keeping the strength in the arms. That's it. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna put the brakes on, hold, and lift the knees as if you're climbing upstairs. So draw that lower belly in. We don't want to be leaning back, okay? We're standing tall, drawing the knees up, lifting the chest. All right, moving on. Take a look. We're gonna lift, take it down, circle the toe. Lift, tap, circle. Again, lift, tap, circle. One more time, lift, tap, let's reverse the circle. Lift, tap, circle. So whichever way you were doing it last time, take the circle the opposite way. Warming up the hips here. Circle that toe, keeping the toe on the ground. Good, we're moving to the other side. Here we go. Lift, tap, circle. You can even let the toe just hover off the ground rather than keeping it on the floor. That'll wake up the hips even more, wake up your balance. All right, we're switching, reverse the circle. Let's go, lift, tap, circle, good. Lift, still using that belly to keep yourself lifted. Chest is up, that's it, one more. You got it, guys. All right, let's climb those stairs. Here we go, step and lift, two by two. Getting that heart rate up, if you want, push to the ceiling, raise those arms up. Nice work, everyone. We're gonna bring the elbow down to the opposite knee. Here we go. Getting that belly warmed up, warming up the side bodies, reaching knee to elbow. Slight twist of the torso there. Maybe you can feel this in the outside of the hips. Stay with it, let's go. Lift, reach. Ooh, big breaths in. That's it. Beautiful. For four, you got it. Three. Two, last time. Nice work, everyone. All right, let's set the feet outside of the hips. Easy squat. Start to sit the butt back like you're sitting in a chair and lifting and rising. Good. Press down into the heels. Lift and squeeze the glutes as you reach the top. Check your posture. Make sure your knees are not going past your toes, okay? Beautiful. Keeping that chest up. Relaxing the shoulders down from the ears. Staying nice and open in the heart space. That's it, everyone. All right, let's step one leg back. Setting up for a lunge. Hips are square. Back heel lifted. Dropping right down through center. Lifting up. All right, drawing that lower belly in. Staying nice and strong. So that your lower back is supported. You can drop that heel going right down through center. Good, hold, let's tap that toe in. Take it slow. Press down into that front foot. Make sure the knees don't come past the toes. Let's go, speed it up. That's it, that's it. Tap it in, come on guys. Beautiful. Can you pick that knee up? Draw the lower belly in. Use it for support here. Heart rate's coming up. We're gonna take it out to the side. Take the tap out the side. That's it. Press down into that standing foot. Big breath in, pull the knee up. There you go, good. Waking up that hip right there. Nice work team, let's come back to center. Plant those feet, feet outside hips are slightly wider. Sit back, 
and rise. Nice little squat. We're still in the warm up. No need to go all the way down. Give me one more. All right, let's step the opposite foot back. Set up for that lunge. Hips are square. Front knee over the ankle. Drop, press and rise. Press into the big toe down of that front foot. Nice work, everyone. Give me four more here. Big breath in. That's it. Beautiful. All right, here we go. Shift the weight into the front foot. Tap. Start to tip with the hip. Reaching the crown of the head up and forward. When you're ready, speed it. Press down into that foot. Raise that knee when you're ready. Pull it up. Big breath. That's it. Good. Keep that core nice and stable. Take it out the side. Tap it in. Stay strong. Here we go, here we go. Knee up, lift. Pull it in. Breathe. Pump those arms. Heart rate elevated. Four more. Four. Three. Two. One. Good. Feet to center. Squat. That's it, guys. Get the feet just outside hips or slightly wider. Four more. We're finishing this off strong. We're going to move into our first working track. Two more. And last one here. Press down into those feet to rise up. Nice finish. All right, let's grab some weights. We're working in our back track. So if you have heavier weights, we've got a larger muscle group. I'm going to show you the profile. We're going to roll the shoulders onto the back. Keep the heart space lifted. Feet are under hips are slightly wider. Let's bend those knees and drop the tailbone back. We're gonna tip from the hip and hinge. Allow the weights to draw you down. Press into the feet and rise up. So key points here. You don't want the shoulders to start rolling in, okay? Make sure you're actively pulling the shoulder blades together on the back. So that your chest is staying broad. Your heart space is staying lifted as you tip from the hip. Make sure you're bending your knees as you look all over the cliff. So when you look over a cliff, you want to stay solid in those feet so that you're not falling forward, right? Press down into the feet to rise up. Beautiful. Set that tailbone away. You got it. Nice work, everyone. One more. All right. We're going to take the weights into one hand. So both weights in one hand. You're going to see what this feels like to offset the weight. Coming into a deadlift. So we're putting all the weight into one side. But the matter of fact is that the other side is also having to work just as hard to keep your balance. So draw on that core. Navel draws up to the spine. As you take a look over that cliff, take your gaze down. Keep pulling those shoulder blades together. Check the next option. If you want, you can start to raise the opposite arm out to the side. So one weight down, one weight out. Four more. Keep sinking and lowering, pressing down to rise up. Keeping a nice flat back. Every time you're lifting, you're lifting with the whole body. Two. One more. That's it, everyone. Let's take the weight into the other hand. Option, both weights, one hand. Tip over the cliff and rise up. Squeezing those glutes as you reach the top. Always using that belly. See how the back stays nice and flat? There's no rounding, okay? Making sure you're bending those knees as you're sticking the butt back. Don't be shy. Just stick that tailbone behind. Crown of the head draws forward. If you want to add on, one weight up to the side, one weight lowers down. Strengthening the upper back, the shoulder. Always keeping that core nice and tight to support your lower back. Nice work, everyone. Stay with it. Beautiful. All right, take one more. All right, let's rise up. Let's take the weights to the shoulders. Let's add a different feeling. When we focus the weight closer to the core, you gotta use those abdominal muscles. Keep your 
back is nice and flat. Keep drawing that navel in. Taking the crown of the head. Sending the tailbone back. Feel that stretch in your hamstrings as you rise and squeeze the glutes. Feel the stretch in the front of your hips as you tip over. Four more like this. Beautiful. Strengthening the whole core. Stretching those hamstrings for three. Two. Keep taking your gaze down. One more. That's it. Stand up nice and tall. We're going to bring the weights with the palms back. Lift them up through center and lower them down. So pressing down into those feet, making sure your feet are hip width distance apart at least. Bending those knees, allowing the tailbone to drop down. Lift those weights right up the front body, allowing the elbows to lead the way. Four more. For four. You got it. Three. We're gonna stay with this for now. Two. And one more. Then we're gonna bring the heads of the weights together. Push the weights together as you sip up the front. Can you feel that a little bit more in your shoulders? Press the weights together. Right in the, up the front body as if you're zipping up a shirt or a coat. Elbows are leading the way. Let's stay with it. Here we go for four. Beautiful, strengthening those shoulders. The upper back for three. Let's do this for two. Nice work, guys. One more. All right, one wide, one narrow. Taking one wide row, bringing the weights together, zip it up. Again, wide, elbows are always leading, keeping the heart space lifted. Make sure you're relaxing those shoulders from the ears. So no creaking up here, okay? Relax, four more. Lift, and raise it up. The elbows wide here for three, zipping them together. That's it. Keep those knees slightly back. We're almost there for two. Keep lifting that heart space. One more set here, guys. Finish off strong. That's it. Zip it up. Beautiful. All right, guys. Get rid of those weights. Here we go. 60 seconds, guys. Get those feet moving. So if you want to stay low impact, you just march it out, okay? Get your knees up. Pump your arms. Our first cardio track. So this is your body. Let your heart come up. Nice and easy. Okay, big breaths in. Maybe reach those arms up. Pull it down as you lift the heels behind you. That's it. Find a way to move that suits where you're at. Maybe you're taking a jog. Getting the heels up. Getting the knees up. Maybe you're skipping rope. It feels pretty good to me right now. I'm going to try this for a little bit. If you want something else, you can do a low impact jumping jack. Standing out to the side, coming back. Or arms all the way up or full jumping jack. Where are you guys at today? What are you feeling, okay? Ask yourselves what feels good and go with it to get your heart rate lifted. That's what this is all about, okay? Working with our bodies. That's it, come on, stay to the end, guys. We're definitely keeping it alive up here. We're kicking it up. Let's go, let's go, almost there. Beautiful, all right, we're gonna get ready for our core and back work in this track. So grab some weights if you've got them on hand. You can leave them out if you don't need them, but they'll help with a little bit of wrist support. Okay, coming to the top of your space. Setting the feet hip width distance apart. Rolling the shoulders back. Bend those knees. We're gonna start with squat. Resting the weights down. Step back into the plank, or knees are down. Lift one leg for four. Cover the toe for three. Squeeze the glute for two, and one. Other leg, lift. Four, so you can do this from your knees, or right from your toes. Two, one, step it in. Coming back to the squat, pressing into the feet, rising up. Drop down, starting with the opposite foot this time. Lift for four. You got it, press the heel away for three. Two, switch to the other side. So if you're on your knees, three, that's fine. Two, shoulders are over wrist, and one, step in, rise. Keep moving with your breath, not holding the breath. 
stacking the shoulders over the wrist, lifting that back foot. Three, two, squeezing down the whole back. Switching to the other leg for four. Three, you got this guys. Belly draws in, step in, rise up, full body work. Let's stay with it. First, step back, lift. Four, three, come on everyone. Switch this feet, let's go. Four, three, strengthening the core, waking up a whole body. I know you guys are probably sweating by now. I'm feeling it, let's step it back. Let's stay with it. Four, three, two, one. Keeping those shoulders over the wrist, pressing away from the ground. Try not to dump into those hands. Step it up, woo! Let's stay with it, let's go. We're gonna finish this off strong. Almost there for four, three, two, one. If you need to, drop down to your knees for four, three, two, one. Step it in for a squat, press your feet and rise. Come on, keep going, let's go. Stay with me, guys. Four, three, two, one. Draw that lower belly up. Back of the heart space lifts. That's it, step in. Woo! That's it, nice work everyone. All right, coming back to center. If you wanna grab a quick drink, feel free. Otherwise, we're gonna come into some squats. So, as I said earlier, I'm taking it a little bit easier today. So I'm gonna drop the weights for our squats. It's sufficient to use your body weight when we're doing our squat exercises. Lots of repetition and you can make sure you've got proper form in your feet. So let's step the feet outside of your distance, toes slightly out, heels in, drop the tailbone, press and rise. Good, so sitting back into those heels. You should almost feel as if your toes are rising up. All your weight is going back. Keep the heart space up. I'll show you from the side. That's it. If you need to take your feet even wider, <laughs> everybody's happy. bodies are shaped You're differently. Crazy, so you find what works. If you've got some weights, maybe you add a curl. Curl them up to the shoulders. Palms can be facing forward, or thumbs can be to the tops of the weights. Okay, bicep curl. All right, here we go. If you want a bit more, add a press with the weights. If you don't have any weights, no problem. When you raise your arms above your head, you're still gonna elevate that heart rate. You're still working harder. Let's go, let's go. Press and lift. Big breath in everyone. Make sure you're sitting that butt back and low. Four more. Four. Weights in front of the face for three. Two. Beautiful. All right, we're gonna come back. Take the feet even wider for a plie squat. This time, palms are facing back. You're pressing into the pinky toe edge of those feet. Knees are tracking over the ankle. We're working the inner thighs, working the glutes. Make sure you're drawing that tailbone in, okay? Sorry, draw the lower belly in so the tailbone extends down. Nice and strong in the core. Chest is lifted. Add a row. If you want, if you've got some weights on hands, roll those weights up the front body. Elbows lead the way. Make sure your shoulders are relaxed. Keep pressing into the outer edges of those feet. Big breath in. Nice work, guys. Four more. Four. Keep that heart space open. Three, two. Take a look. Lift the palms. Open up the palms. Drop and press. Take the weights up overhead. Once again, raising that heart rate. Make sure your knees are staying over those ankles. What I mean by that is that they're not falling in. You're pressing into the outer edges of the feet. Raise it up, here we go. Four, three, two, one. Nice work, bring the weights down. Let's heel toe those feet back in. Coming to a comfortable set squat position. Feet are hip width distance or slightly wider. Toes out, heels in. Roll the shoulders down. 
Here we go. Reset. Sitting that butt back. I'll show you the profile. Keeping that spine nice and long. Imagine a string attached to the crown of your head. It's pulling your head up as you rise. Add a curl. So palms can face back or thumbs to the top of the weight. Whatever's comfortable for you. Focusing that work in our posture. Pressing down into the heels. Let's go for four. Big breath in. Three. Two. Eyes up. Out of press. If you want a bit more. Even if you don't have any weights, raising those arms overhead is going to elevate that heart rate. Come on, let's go. Let's bring it up, guys. Reach. Beautiful work. Eight. Come on, press down to rise. Big breath in. Don't hold the breath. Four more. Four. Three. Two. One. Good job. Lower the weights. Take the feet even wider. Plie squat. Palms face back. Press into the pinky to wedges of the feet. Drop and rise. So I want you to make sure your knees are tracking over those ankles. So don't let them fall in, okay? Press into the pinky toe edges of the feet. Add a row. Drop, row. Zip those weights in front. Relax the shoulders. Whose heart rate's coming up? I'm with you. I feel you. Let's take it higher. Let's go. Four. Big breath in. Three. Two. One. Open up the palms. Drop and press. Here we go, let's go, let's go. Reach it up. You ready guys? Final set. Eight. Weights in front of the face, push them forward. Six. Drop and rise. You got this for four. Stay strong to the end for three, two, one. Nice work, bring the weights down. Heel to those feet, here we go guys. Get those feet either jogging on the spot, marching on the spot. Lifting those knees up, maybe pulling it down while you're at it. Get those arms in, or also, like we started in the beginning. Opposite elbow, opposite knee. Adding a little bit of core work here. Working the hips. If you've got an elliptical, if you've got a treadmill, hop on it, come on. We've got about 35 more seconds. Bring it up, bring it up. Reach the arms out, take them out to the side. Come on guys, we're gonna finish this off strong. Let's go, let's go. Get the whole body moving. Heels up in the back or knees up in the front. Let's go, come on. Almost there, almost there. Move around your space. Keep it alive, keep it alive. Ah, heart rate's coming up for sure. Definitely feeling alive on this Monday morning, guys. Come on, bring the heat. Let's go. Let's elevate it. Push it up, push it up. Woo! Come on, big breath in. Almost at the end. Woo! Nice work, grab a quick drink everyone. Let's focus on the upper body. Grabbing some weights, smaller muscle groups, so your choice. We're gonna come in for some biceps. Always finding that strong set position. Feet are under hips are slightly wider. Bending the knees to drop the tailbone. Okay, open up the palms forward. Curl the weights up in front. Good, so making sure you're not locking your knees out. Slight bend in the knees, engaging the lower belly. Can you feel your heart rate? Are you breathing a little bit harder? That means it's working. We're gonna keep that blood rushing to all those muscles. Keep toning that heart. Let's work on some upper body strength right here. Imagine you've got 25 pound weights in each hand. You're not swinging, you're using strength. Squeezing as you pull them up. You got it, guys. One more. Let's face the palms in. Thumbs to the top of the weight. Hammer curl. Working the muscle in a different way here. Creating that rounding in the bicep. Can you feel the difference? Maybe you feel it a little bit more in your shoulder. Make sure your knees are still bent gently, okay? You're still drawing your navel to your spine. Give yourselves a smile. You guys are doing awesome. Monday morning, we're here, we're together. That's what counts. 
Good. All right, guys, take the palms back. All right, back curl. So keeping the elbows lowered, thumbs are to the inside of the weight. Good. Remember, no swinging. Keeping a nice long spine. Palms are opening to the front. Good. Palms are facing back. Open and down. Drawing up and in on that belly. Keeping that nice strong posture. Let's go for four. Beautiful. Three. Can you feel this a little bit more on the forearm? Two. And one. Coming back to our starting point. Palms open. Strong step position. Roll the shoulders back. Curl. Curl. Nice work, everyone. Keep those knees slightly bent. Dropping that tailbone down. You got it. Curl it up. Big breath in. One more. All right, hammer curl. Palms face in. Oh, whose arms are getting tired here? All that digging and the gardening. I'm feeling it. Stay with me, guys. I'm right there with you. Let's finish this off strong. Breathe in, four more. Four, you got it. Three, two, one. Palms down, palms back, back curl for eight. We're gonna finish this off. Seven, elbows face to the ground. Six, big breath in. Keep that chest up. Four, no swinging. Three, breathe in for two. Final one, strong. Nice work, roll it out. Coming in for our lunges. All right, so you might wanna step back in your space. We're gonna start with an alternating forward lunge. Feet are hip width distance apart, hands on hips. Let's step forward, drop, lift, and back. Other leg, forward, drop, up, and back. The other option here, if you have the space, you can walk your lunge. Okay, I don't quite have the space. So your choice. Forward, drop, up, step, step, drop, up, and in. Or just alternating step, forward, step. That's it. Let's go. Forward, drop, up, and in. Nice work, Marcia. Turn it around. Good job. Use your space, guys. Move around. Move your body in a different way. One more. Beautiful. All right, let's bring one foot forward. Same leg stays forward. Front knee over front ankle. Regular lunge. Make sure this knee's not going past those toes. Keeping the hands on the hips. Good. Keep those shoulders lowered down from the ears. That's it, guys. If you want a little bit more, we're going to add a curl. Let's go. Thumbs to the top of the weights. Hammer curl. Press down into that front foot to rise up. Back heel presses away. You got it. Lower belly draws in. Nice work, team. Ready? We're gonna add a press. Push. Beautiful. Reach it up high. Weights are staying in front of the face. Keeping your balance by locking that core in. Nice work, team. Heart rate comes up. Let's go, let's go. Reach it up. Big breath in. Everybody, take it down slow, slow. Slow through the middle, press up slow. Flush that leg out, again. Drop it slow, back heel stays lifted. Back knee dropping right through center. One more time, drop, hold, hold. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Step it in. Woo! Shake that out, guys. You feel that? We're moving on to the other side. Here we go. Getting those feet set up hip width distance apart. Starting with that forward stepping lunge or walking your lunge. Step, drop, up, and back. Step, drop, lift, and back. So we're pushing off that front foot to return to the starting position. Using that core to keep stable. Beautiful, move around your room and walk your lunge. If you have this base, 
That's it, guys. We want to keep our moves dynamic all the time. Fitness for life. That's what this is. So when you're walking, you're walking forward. You're not always just walking, stepping, and then stepping back, right? So if you can, step together, switch. Good. Stay with it. A couple more here. Step, drop, up, lift. Take a big breath in. One more each side. That's it, guys. Good work. Opposite leg is coming forward this time. Regular lunge, back heel lifts. Back knee goes right down through center. I'll show you the profile. Front knee stays over that front ankle. Good. Lower belly draws in. Big breath in. Relax the shoulders. Nice work, team. If you want to add the upper body, add a curl. Curling it up, thumbs to the top of the weights. You don't have to. You can just allow your arms to rest down by your side. Big breath in. You got this, team. Let's go. Four. Press into that front foot. Three. Two. Add a push. Let's go. Reach. Weights are staying in front of the face. Take a big breath in. Heart rate's going to come up. Four. Three. Two. Four more. Let's go. Four. Three. Press into that front foot. Last one. Take the weights down. Slow. 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 Rise. Woo! Can you guys feel that? My heart rate's lifted. Let's go. Slow. Last one, hold, hold, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Step in. Oh my gosh. You guys feel that in those legs? All right, come on, come back to you. Let's flush those legs out. Let's keep it a little bit low if you need to. You're just taking a march. Maybe stepping out and back. Woo! I definitely feel that in my quads. My legs are feeling like jelly. Or taking the arms all the way up. Finding what feels good for you guys here. That's it, that's it. If you want to do a jog, get on your elliptical. Go on, smash it. Come on, let's go. This is up to you guys. How much energy can you bring in here? I see you guys, I feel you. Come on, there's Marilyn, Marcia. We got Kathy, Daniela, Bettina, Lynn, and Joanne, Catherine, Sandra, Rosaria, and Jocelyn. Let's go. Come on, guys. Time to bring it out. Spread it around. Second last cardio. Keep it alive. Keep it alive. Big breath in, everyone. Come on. Pick it up. Pick it up. Ah. Uh, if you just want to dance. Ha, 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 ha. Woo. Take it all out. Move those hips. Keep it shaking. Woo! Nice work, guys. Grab a quick trick. But first, we're gonna work on those triceps. For all you gardeners out there, we need our triceps for some shoveling. We need to work the back side of the body, right? All right, here we go. Get your feet in a strong set position. Roll the shoulders onto the back. Open up the palms. We're gonna tip from the hip. So heart space stays open. Tipping over, pressing into the heels. Row the elbows right into the torso and straight back behind you. Keeping them hugging in towards the midline. Palms are facing open. Keep lifting that heart space. Drawing that navel, your belly button, up into the spine. Okay, so don't let it go slack. Also, don't round. Pull the shoulders back. It's an exaggerated movement. Let's do it properly. Let's focus on our form. Keep extending that tailbone back behind you by bending those knees. Good. Four more. Four. Three. Take your gaze down for two. One. Hold. We're going to keep the slight bend in the elbows as we raise the palms. Keeping the elbows drawing in towards the torso. Keeping the arms hugging in towards the body. Palms are coming to face down. 
keeping the elbows slightly bent. Working those triceps right here. Working the biceps as well, the entire arm. Breathe in, use your core to keep stable. For four, give yourselves a smile, guys. Here, you should be proud of yourselves. I'm proud of you. Two, you're doing awesome. One, good job. All right, palms are going to face in. Strong set position, row. Palms facing in towards one another. Hugging the elbows into the midline. Keep taking that gaze down. You got it, team. Keep trying the lower belly and keep it nice and strong. Heart space lifted. We're going to add a kickback. Here we go. Extend the arms back. Bend the elbows and down. In. Keep the elbows bent. Good. That's it. Extending them back. As if you're a skier. You're looking down the cliff. Reaching those poles back. Picking up speed. Keep it strong here. Here we go. Four. Three. Keep tipping from the hip. Two. One. Press down. Rise up. Roll your shoulders out. We're coming back in. Tip from the hip. This time, palms face forward. Throw it up to the belly button. Imagine you're holding on to a barbell. Barbell's pulling into the belly. Elbows pulling together into the torso for four, three, two, one. Keep the elbows bent. Raise the arms. Eight, seven, six. Keep squeezing. Use control. Five, four. If this is too much on your lower back, you can rise up. Just slight bend. Two, one. Good job. This time, palms face in. Squeeze the elbows back. Seven. Six. Let's finish this off strong. Five. Four. Navel the spine for three. Keep that heart space lifted for two. One. We're going to add the kickback. Let's go. Extend and lower. Beautiful. Keep those elbows bent for eight. This is it. Seven. Big breath in, guys. We got this. Keep the shoulders relaxed. For four. Three, let's finish off strong. Two, one, that's it. Drop those arms, roll them out. Let go of those weights. We got one more cardio. Let's go, biggest cardio you got. All right, this is it, 60 seconds on the clock. Come on, come with me. Bring your heart rate right to the top. Big breath in, get those knees up. Reach the arms up, reach them out. Maybe you drop some rope. Maybe you jump jacks. Maybe you take it low impact. Whatever you're feeling, maybe you march, lift the knees, maybe you get the heels up in the back. All right, what do you want to do? Add a jog on the spot. Let's go, let's go. Side to side, side to side. Working each side of the body. Let's go, let's go. Beautiful, come on team. Let's raise it to the end, you can see the finish line. Here we go, here we go. We're almost there, let's go. Let's bring it around the room. Let's celebrate our earnings, let's go guys. Reach up, take the arms out. Spread your energy around your space. Give it back to yourself. Then take it around the other way. Woo! Keeping it alive to the end. Here it is. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Woo! Uh, <laughs> that's it, that's it, team. Nice work. Good work, warrior. Give yourself a good stretch and hit like and subscribe for more high-livity workouts.